So just before I head out today, just a quick look at how I actually rig this kayak. It's a sit-in. So it's a little bit different than what a lot of the guys have for fishing. I have a nice big flag, stands up, gives me visibility. Use a bungee cord and the carry strap to put my net on the back. That way it's accessible. I don't use it a lot, but sometimes you do need it. And then inside the cabin area where there's limited space in a sit-in, I've got a pair of gloves. I always bring pliers. I bring fish grips and I bring jaw spreaders. All tools that really, really help you on the water. Less important than a big boat where you've got lots of room to move. Very important in a kayak where you need to be able to keep one hand free sometimes to actually maneuver yourself while you're handling a fish with the other. I keep all my spare fishing gear up front in the open area. I can reach forward and pull out whatever I need. I've labeled all of the individual containers with what's inside so that I can easily reach and find them. Fish finder obviously on one side, GoPro on the other, paddle, and then in the seat area, anchor my spinner baits. Use every inch of storage space, so I've got my safety gear. Rain jacket that I always carry out, it's also great for cutting the wind if it gets cooler and windy out there. The fish attractant and my off repellent. Also sometimes store the anchor back there, but I might be using it this morning, so I've got that in front of the seat where it's handy. Finally, whatever soft plastics I'm going to use, I just keep up beside the seat or in between my feet right at hand. On top of the hull, just to the right of the cockpit, I've mounted an anchor cleat. It's with an easy reach for quick anchoring in calm water. For other situations, I've got a strong cord and carabiner running most of the length of the boat down the side of the hull. It's adjustable forward and back to anchor me in any wind conditions. I don't really fish in heavy currents, so for me, this simple, inexpensive setup is pretty much perfect. I've got a seven inch hummingbird, which is a pretty big unit for this kayak, but hey, I didn't buy a big boat, so I got money for the toys. I mount the battery up underneath in a waterproof case. Just make sure if you've got a setup like this that you check, make sure the power's gonna come on, everything's linked up properly before you get out in the water. Otherwise, you gotta pull all your gear out from the cabin storage there, and it's a real pain in the butt when you get on the water and the, have to check the connections. The fishing poles themselves, I've got two mounted units on the back of the kayak. I can also use one of them for a net if I'm only bringing out two poles, but because I'm going out for a very long time, I want to have all my poles rigged. So I'm going to go with three of them today. And the third one just stays between my legs. And that's my basic setup. 